Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Lurch and welcome back to my Iron Man account. As for the last episode, I got some major goals done being the Wilderness Hard Diaries, got the Kandarin Hard Diaries, and also managed to get myself up to 85 Slayer, along with some new monsters and some new drops. But my plans for this episode are actually pretty straightforward. What I would like to do is get from 85 to 87 Slayer, and obviously on the journey there, there'll be a lot of Basilisk tasks and Shaman tasks and things like that, so hopefully you get some new items. And then obviously at 87 I get the chance to get myself a trident, which is just useful in a ridiculous amount of places, so I would really love to get that before the episode is out. And then when that's all said and done, I guess I gotta use the trident for a bit of a test run, so I'll probably send another 50 barrows or so. So, without further ado, let's kick it off with some Slayer. I actually can't believe it's taken that long to get one of them, but there is my first ever curved bone on the account. And there's the first level coming in, level 83 defense. And I'm pretty sure, yep, that also puts me at 110 combat, very nice. 84 attack. Bit of a random place to get a Herblore level, but there is level 77 Herblore, which is a really nice one too, because I no longer have to boost for stamina pots. And there's a nice little milestone kill there that'll put me at 50 kills at KBD. Nice little combat task there done too. There's 92 hit points coming in. Alrighty, got myself a few clues to open up. I was planning on stacking a lot more, but I just can't contain myself when I, <laughs> I gotta open them. We'll start off with these free beginner caskets, see if we can get a Union Unique. Straight away we can, the shoulder pair, very nice. I'll whack him on for good luck. And for beginner number two, <laughs> for a pick, nice. Nice little steel set, and for the medium, is that another Unique? It is, getting very, very lucky. And I guess it'd be rude not to throw on the white elegant blouse as well. Oh, I take that back, I can't, I can't wear that, it can only bring bad luck if I've got that on. Alright, for the five hards, not bad. A Cyclops head, alright. Tell you what, I rake it in the unique. <laughs> rake it in the uniques, I'm gonna keep that on too. <laughs> Three more to open up. Bugger all in that one, bugger all in that one. And for the final clue, another Cyclops head. Alright, well, I've got two eyes now, no longer a Cyclops. 84 defense. And there is a nice little surprise, as you can see in the chat box, there is my first ever Dragon Spear, which I've actually been needing one of them. I think it's for an Elite or a Master Clue Step, so very, very nice to get that. I guess I can finally take this Ring of Wealth off. There is level 86 Slayer. And there is another Shaman Task down, for your sake and mine. I wouldn't mind seeing how many we have complete now. 522, so just over 10% of the way to the drop rate. It's uh, pretty disappointing to think about, to be honest. 85 attack. 85 defense. Alrighty, about to pick up my 250 of task. This will be a huge, huge point boost. Hopefully a decent task. Uh, I'm cancelling that, because I just straight up don't like blue dragons. Cancel that. And now, something nice, please. What do you got for me, mate? Dagonoff. Too easy. And there it is, 250 tasks for 525 points. Very nice. And there's 84 range coming in with the cannon. Always staying up to date with those farm runs. And there is level 96 farming. So close now. Alrighty, got myself a few more caskets. One easy, one medium, and five hard. Let's see if we can snag any more uniques. First for the beginner, for nothing. Can't expect much. And for the mediums, purple sweets. Fire lighters, junk, junk, and for the final one, unfortunately not a unique, I already have that one, I'll just bank this and open up the hards. Just notice in the chat box too, that puts me over 100 medium clues now. Alrighty, time for the hards, see if we can snag a unique. What is that? Berserk Lineker's ornament kit, I already got that bad boy unfortunately. Junk. Ah, oh, it's not the page I need, I need one more armor page. Alright, for the final two... A lot of good Alks, and more Tellies. Alright, can't complain. Yeah, it's the Armadil page 4 I need, and then I'll have the Armour book complete, which is the one I actually really want to get. And then apart from that, all I've got left is the Guthix page 2 and 3, and that's all of my books complete. And there we go, I've been waiting a long time for that task. 130k off 87 Slayer, and there's the first Abbey Demon task. I'll take it. 86 attack. And there it is, the level I've been searching for, level 87 Slayer. Alrighty, first thing first. Let's go ahead and extend these bad boys. Where are they down the bottom? Crack on, there we go. 
Now I've heard Juradel is a better base chance of getting Kraken than Neve, so that's why I'm here. And whilst I do have a lot of points for skips, if it's a pretty decent task, I'm just going to go ahead and do it anyway. So let's see if we can get that task. Cave Kraken straight away! No fucking chance. First task. Wow. Alrighty, have just arrived, and I went ahead and made myself some bracelets of slaughter as well, just so I can get a few extra kills. So let's see if we can get lucky and get it on this first task. Actually, I actually had no idea what to wear, I just watched one of uh, Mr. Mammal's old Iron Man videos and <laughs> seen this as he set up, so we'll go with it, and wish me luck. Hey, uh, there it is. Oh, finally have a trident on the account. Let me get out of here, I gotta go check this bad boy out. Oh my goodness. Trident achieved. <laughs> oh my god. That is just useful in so many places. Before I move on, let's have a sneaky look at the log. I know it's a 1 in 200 drop, I believe, and I got very lucky. 70 kills for that, so yep, way under the drop rate. And as I said earlier in the episode, I would love to test this out at Barrows. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. But before I do that, I actually have a few Scutizo totems in my bank from when I was doing Slayer. So I'll go punch them out first, and then off to Barrows. Alrighty, so I got myself four totems, starting off with 40 onyx bolt tips, not bad at all, and an elite, I'll take it. Scotizo kill number two, four free root plane bodies, very nice. Kill number three, also putting me at a total of 20kc, not too bad at all, for 60 raw anglers. And for the fourth and final kill, what can we snag? Some runite bars and another elite clue, very nice. So I just killed a Ceridomon Wizard doing this clue, and he should, uh, he should actually land it up in the tree. <laughs> That's a new one, haven't seen that before. Alrighty, just finished up with all the clues, leaving me with six hard and two elites. See if we can snag any more uniques. Nothing in the first, rubbish in the second, nothing, nothing, nothing. That's, that's up there, probably my worst hard ever. <laughs> Room plate, alright, come on, give me one unique. Oh, nothing. Alright, time for the elites. And for the elite clues, bugger all in the first, 130k, and in the second, <laughs> alright, a bit more value, I'll take it. And now of all the clues down, and the slayer done, and the trident done, it is time to send some more barrows. I'm up at, I think it's 350 I'm at at the moment, so I might send another 50, and knock that out to 400. Alrighty, I've just arrived back at barrows, and just for a little recap, we'll go ahead and look at the collection log. 350 chests opened, 13 items, well 12 if you don't include the bolt racks. And I do actually have a little bit of a plan, if I somehow manage a full set, then things are going to go on a little bit of a detour. But let's go send 50 chests and hope for the best. And the first chest back, see if we can snag a cheeky item. Nah, no good, a lot of chaos runes, but... Just missed the level, I didn't even know that was coming up, but there is level 93 hit points. And I'm pretty sure that puts me at, yep, 112 combat. It's finally happened, I finally got another quiz master. Come on, give me that baguette. Do it! Ah, oh, diamond, not bad. Also, while I'm here, that's 11 chests down. No luck as of yet. Well, you don't see them very often. There's a D med on chest 362. Chest 369, brand new item. Verax Brassard, thanks for coming. Now give me a proper look at that bad boy. Oh yeah, very nice, getting the pecs out. And that puts me one piece off a full set as well. All I need now is the skirt. And the Verax set is actually one of the more useful sets that you can get. So I'd love to get that. That'd be awesome. Chest number 370 going for the back-to-back. -back. Ah, no good. Yeah, there's another new item. The Carol's Coif. Very nice. Also one off a full set. I think I just need the Carol's Top now. So it was only the K-Top that I'm currently missing. So it's now three sets where I'm only missing one item off a full set. So when I get that, I'm actually not too far off the Moritani Elite Diaries. And for the back-to-back, -back, no good. There's 91 magic coming in. Alrighty, 50 chests down. Good luck to this guy. This will be chest number 400 for bugger all, but a lot of chaos runes again. I've been cleaning up the chaos. So go ahead and tally out. Have a look at the price checker here. Just on the right of screen, 2.7 mil, not bad at all. A lot of runes, a lot of nice runes. And I was pretty lucky with the items. I managed the two items and they were both uniques. And now that that's complete, there is one more thing that I actually wanted to do before I rounded out the episode. And that was going on a bit of an easy clue hunt. Um, I've had a fair few clues now that required either a bob shirt or the flared trousers. And it's just, 
just very frustrating having to drop them all the time and clues are one of my favourite things to do. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do the same as Barrows. I think I'm just going to go ahead and grind out 50 easy clues and then open them all up at once. So I guess I'll see you back in 50 clues time. I've just been blessed by another quiz master. This is the day where I get the stale baguette. This is the day. Oh, easy clue. Nice. <laughs> That's actually what I'm looking for. So recently in my AFK time, in between doing clues and you know farm runs and things like that, I've just been doing uh, shooting stars, actually. It's something I've never done before. Got myself up to almost 9k dust now, just as this rock goes out. But uh, the plan is to get around, I think, 14k I need to get the full gold outfit, just mainly for the fashion scape. Like, literally has no point apart from that, but I want it anyway, <laughs> just for no reason. And also to get myself, I can't remember the name of the ring, but there's a ring that gives a plus four mining boost, which is very useful. So I'll be doing that in my AFK time from now on. And I also just managed to get myself 80 mining and 19.25 total. <laughs> very nice. Alrighty, been doing a fair bit of AFKing as of late and actually managed to get myself that 14,000 Stardust. So now it's time to finally use it. Get myself the Celestial Ring, that's the name of it, I could not remember. And that will give me a plus four mining boost, which is very nice. And with the remaining dust, Time to buy another four star fragments. And now I believe I just use them with each other. Yes. All right, that's all the pieces. Let's whack it on and have a look, eh? Ah, oh, very, very nice. I like it, I like it. And also if I take a little peek in the collection log, that'll be the shooting stars bit complete. It's always nice to see that, uh, that green text in the collection log. Alrighty, time to get back to getting easy clues, as you can see in the inventory. Currently have 36, so 14 more to go, and then we'll open them all up. Alrighty, finally have all of my clues. I have 1 medium, 9 beginners, and 50 easies. The, uh, the medium and beginners I just got while I was mining and just getting imps while I was running around doing the easy clues. So I think I'll start it off with the beginners and the medium. Alrighty, see if we can get lucky. First off with the medium clue. What do we got? Morton Tellies. I'll take it. Now for the beginners, six laws. So for whatever reason, the clip I just made of me opening up all the beginners just corrupted and got deleted. So that sucks, but I didn't get any uniques anyways. No big loss. Uh, sitting at 64 beginner clues now. Now I'm gonna crack open all these easies. And we'll just have a quick peek of the collection log. Go into clues, easy clues. Currently sitting at 22 uniques. So if I could snag a few, that would be very nice. So uh, start opening up now, eh? First clue, unique. Bang, straight off the, <laughs> off the crack. Gotta love it. Rubbish, rubbish, rubbish. Actually, I'll take the firelighters. I've been saving up to get 250 to recolor my Phoenix anyway, so. Can't complain with the firelighters. Another unique, black plate legs T. Number 43, more junk. I'm assuming I'll probably get a master throughout this too. There's a amulet of magic trimmed. Bob shirt, there's the big thing I've been looking for. I've had a lot of clues now that require me to have a Bob shirt. I've just had to drop them all, so I'll throw that bad boy in for good luck and open up the rest. Very nice. <laughs> and 40 remaining. Elf camp tellies, always nice. Felt up tellies. I'm after some uh, Twibo one and Trio tellies. They're the ones I really want. And there's another unique blue skirt G. Very nice, throw that bad boy on. Lovely, lovely. Trout. <laughs> Some black gear, coif, there's another Zemi page. Still searching for that armadillo page, we'll get it one day. Lunar Isle telly is very nice. Studded body, junk. What have we got unique here? Oh, there's the armadillo page, is that the full book? I fucking hope it is, I think it might be. It is, there we go, there is my full armadillo book. Oh, I've been waiting for that for a long time. Let me chuck the pages in. Oh, lovely. Book of Law in my possession. Very good. I forgot to put the page in the bank first, so it looks pretty scuffed um, along the list of pages. But there is now every book complete, apart from the Guthix book, which I need two more pages for. So, it's actually pretty nuts. Closing on all of the books complete already. Very nice. 28 to go, almost halfway. Rubbish. Oh, another unique. Lever Body G. Very nice. Give that out to the pewers. Bit of cash. Can't complain of GP. Oh, another rainbow. <laughs> That's a pretty cool item, actually. I like it. Even though I've already got one. It's pretty suave. I'll take it. No master clues as of yet. There's another page. So, don't know what I think it was. More black gear. 
Rubbish, rubbish. Junk, junk, junk. Come on, give me something. Oh, uh, there we go, to go with the bottoms. Wizard robe, G top. Very nice. I really gotta stop saying very nice every two seconds. I just had a look in the collection log and I actually have the blue Wizard G hat as well in my POH, so got some nice little fashion scape there to keep me going. 15 clues remaining. Ah, oh, straight into another unique. Black plate leads G. Let's keep cracking them open. Some more tellies. Lumberyard. Actually needed some more Lumberyard tellies. Another G shirt. Man, I'm pulling out the wizard robe. Something chronic. 11, 10. Closing in now. Willow combo. I've really never had a Willow combo before. Find that hard to believe. <laughs> Nine more to open up. Rubbish, rubbish, rubbish. Oh, that is not a unique. That's unfortunate. Neither of them. Wow. Okay. Five more remaining. Not looking good. Not looking good. Uh-oh. And for the final clue, what can we snag? Nothing at all, except for some white fire loaves. Not bad, actually. Alrighty, if I take a little peek in the collection log, we'll see how many slots that filled up. I believe it was... What was it, 22 or something when I opened it? Up to 30 now, so another 8 uniques. Very, very nice. Currently sitting at 105 completed easies now. Take a quick little look through. None of the super rares, unfortunately. I wouldn't mind this gold, uh, <laughs> that gold apron and the gold chef's hat. Looks uh, pretty cool. No team capes, but yeah, not bad at all. We'll do a slow little scroll through so you can have a little gander. As I said, full uh, full wizard robe G. Very nice. The same piece of elegant, unfortunate. And two rainbows. And with that complete, I think I'm going to go ahead and finish up the episode here. Got some very nice uniques, some very nice outfits. More importantly, got the trident, and even more importantly, got myself that bob shirt, so I no longer have to drop those elite clues, finally. But uh, as for next episode, I've also got some more massive plans. There is a few quests which I wish to complete, one of them being the big one, Monkey Madness 2. I've got a lot of herbal supplies which I want to get through. I want to get through all of the Western Diaries up to hard, get myself void, and then get myself elite void after that. I need to do some fletching. There's just so much stuff I need to do. So without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one.